Hi, today we'll be doing some computations of dividing a whole number by a fraction. And to do that, we're going to use the definition that we discussed in another video. Let's review the definition. We have three fractions and B is non-zero. We say A divided by B is another fraction if this, whole, this holds true. So here we have such a situation. We have a whole number divided by a fraction and we, we would like to know what it is. The definition tells you it's another fraction C. So let's, like, let's write that here. Let five divided by one third equals C. And we would like to know what the C is. That's what it means to do this computation. By definition, and I'll write it here, by definition, we can convert this division statement into a multiplicative statement. How do we do that? Follow this. A, A is like your 5, 5 equals C, C is exactly the C, times B, B is like your 1 third, 1 third. So now we are asking, what is the value of C such that C times 1 third is 5? This, can all, this expression can also be interpreted as C copies of 1 third equals 5. And what is that C? So this one, you can um, do the computation using logic as follows. We do know on the number line, 3 copies of a third is 1. And we would like to get 5. So three copies of th one third give you one. Six copies of one third give you two. Nine copies of one third give you three. Twelve copies of one third give you four. So 15 copies of one third is five. So from here, we can get C equals 15. And the reasoning is three copies of one third equals one. And if you like, you can write a longer statement. Hence, 15 copies of one third equals five. Hence, C equals 15. So that's how we've figured this out. Also, one quick observation. Notice C is really 5 times 3. And we can also think of it as 5 times 3 over 1. Just this is simply an observation. But to compute a whole number divided by a fraction, for now, use this logic. Start right out that 5 divided by 1 third is some use a letter to denote that. Using the definition of a division, convert that, translate that, rewrite that, whichever word you prefer, rewrite this uh, division statement as a multiplicative statement. From here on, use the logic. A third, one third. So here we're really looking for C copies of one third. You want that to be five. Three copies of one third give you a one. So if you count like that, 15 copies of one third give you a five. That's how you get C equals five. And if you like, then you can go back and you can write a conclusion. Five divided by one third equals 15. You may, if you like, you may also sketch the number line to show this argument, how three copies of one third equals one and so on. Thank you.